In this video, we'll look at shortcuts that let you work with the ribbon. First, because the ribbon takes up quite a lot of space, you may want to collapse it when you don't need it. On Windows, use Control F1. On a Mac, use Command Alt R. Each time you use this shortcut, you'll toggle the ribbon. The main attraction of the ribbon, from a shortcut's point of view, is accelerator keys. Accelerator keys let you run most commands in Excel from the keyboard, which is especially handy for commands that don't have a dedicated shortcut. Unfortunately, this is a Windows only feature, so it's not available on the Mac. To enable accelerators, press the Alt key. This will select the active tab on the ribbon and display accelerators for navigation. Press the Alt key again to disable accelerators and set focus back to the worksheet. You can use accelerators to navigate tabs and then run a command, all in one step. For example, to sort this list in ascending order, I can press Alt, then A for data, then SA. To sort in descending order, I use Alt A, SD. You can use the escape key to move back up to the top level. For example, Alt H goes to the Home tab. Then, if I press Escape, I'll move back to the top level letters again, and I can press A to go back to the Data tab. Note that once you have a tab selected, you can also use the arrow keys to navigate. As another example, I'll use accelerators to apply right, left, and center alignment. These commands don't have dedicated shortcuts in the Windows version of Excel. Once you have a tab on the ribbon selected, you can use the Tab key to select the first command. Then move through commands using Tab and Shift Tab. With the Control key down, you can use the left and right arrow to move through groups. Once you have a command selected, you can use the space key to open menus and make selections. Remember that although the accelerators are very useful, it'll be faster to use dedicated shortcuts when they exist. For example, even though I can apply bold formatting using accelerator keys and the ribbon, the shortcut Control-B on Windows or Command-B on the Mac is faster.